congratulations on getting your contact buttons purchased. I'm going to show you in this video how you can quickly add them to your agency and the sub accounts and then get the buttons started working right away. So right now, once you get into GHL plugins, the first thing you're going to want to do is go to your user, right? You're going to click on your settings and then it's going to pull up this screen. First thing you want to do is name your agency because it's going to be white labeled here. Then you're going to go over here to links. Once you've saved it, you're going to go ahead and go to links. This is where we're going to create a link for the contact buttons. So you go to add link. You're going to add the service you want to add. So contact buttons. Now in this case, I usually call it um, just add whatever tools that I've added, right? So you're just going to go ahead and copy this URL. Once you're there, you want to go over into your agency. Let's see what tab I have it here up on. And right there. There we go. Perfect. So you're just going to go ahead and create it. Going to go to your agency, your settings, custom menu link here, and just create new. Now, I'm not going to go through and paste this, but you want to select which sub accounts you want to set it on. Once you've done that, you're also going to want to go here. And you're going to get want to get your agency script. Okay? You're going to copy your agency script, and then you're going to drop that. Let's see, right here in the custom JavaScript. So in your agency settings, you're going to go to company, custom JavaScript, paste it, scroll down, click update there, and then you're all set. Now, so what you've done is you've added the custom JavaScript to your agency. You've also added the custom menu link to the sub accounts that you want to work with. So let's see, see exactly how it works here. So now the link that I created for my sub accounts, I call it tools. Now you can see I have a lot of extra tools here, but contact button specifically is right here. You may have seen from some of the other videos, I have a link that says apply this tag and go to link. So how I did that is just click add. Okay, I'm gonna call this new button. I'm going to choose the type. Is this a link or is this a tag? Now the tag, right? I'm just I'm going to say what tag? Tag. Okay, so, and then we're going to select the, the icon. It's two for some reason. And also, one one of the things I've found is having some contrasting colors helps because you don't want all the buttons to look exactly the same. Once you've done that, hit save, and then it's going to populate, go over both the contact area as well as the conversations tab. Now, one thing I want to note on this is depending on how fast GHL servers are refreshing, it can take two to 10 minutes for these buttons to show up. But if you've made them here, they will show up. If they haven't shown up in, after about 10 minutes, contact us. So far, I haven't had any reports of anybody having any problem. But just know that the first time you make those contact buttons, it may take two to 10 minutes. So if you have any questions, please respond to this email or this text, and we'll be glad to help.